Hey, this is about the tech, and today I want to be showing you a quick tutorial on how to install the new Google Chrome operating system on your laptop, netbook, or PC on the Windows machine. This tutorial will show you how to boot the operating system from a USB device, and I'll just walk you through all the steps on how to download, install, and use Google OS. So first you have to go to this website up here and I'll leave the website down below in the description box. You have to go to this website, scroll down, scroll down until you see this, download the USB image and I right click, save link as and I made a new folder and I suggest that you do too. Make a new folder, open it open the folder and then save the file and then once that start downloading you need to download another program called the image writer for windows and then you have to go to this website and I'll leave this site down in the description box you go up here over here right click sorry right click save as and save it to the same folder that you saved the operating system at. So press save and those sh two should start downloading now. Once the download is done you should have two files like this. The first the operating system and the image writer program. If you double click on the operating system and it will load up WinRAR and you need a program called WinRAR is a free program and I'll leave the link below in the description box to download it. You press OK, you press extract and then OK. And then you extract the second file that you downloaded, the image writer program, and you right click extract and it should extract that file. Once both files are extracted, now you should plug in a 2 gig USB drive in, into your computer and then once that is plugged in, open up the image writer program for Windows that you extracted and find this one, and then double click on that and that will bring up this box. Click here to browse to the operating system that you extracted earlier. Double click on that and press OK. And now you should see you should see your USB drive that you plugged in. Click on right and this message will pop up and and it says that uh, this might corrupt your USB drive. Uh, I tried it and it, it did not corrupt my USB drive. I, I was using a 2 gig uh, USB Kingston and so it might corrupt your device uh, depending on which brand you're us using so be cautious about that and then let let it write and once it's complete uh, turn off your computer uh, but make sure the USB stick is still on and uh, so um, make sure the USB stick is still plugged in and uh, turn on your computer and right when you turn press the power button depending on your laptop brand uh, you either press F12 or the escape button on my laptop I press the escape button so right when you press the power button start pressing the escape button or the F12 to boot up the boot menu and then once the boot menu is loaded up uh, select the USB drive that you're, that you're using and then just wait until the wait until it loads from the USB so it's gonna show something like this and once you get into this screen uh, type in face punch and then press enter and then type again for the password face punch so to do that and then press enter and it will take a few minutes to log in it will sign in and then the signing in and this is only a beta version so that means it's a testing version so it's not the complete and I'm sure they're gonna improve uh, in the final and uh, this is it this is the Google Chrome or operating system and uh, like I said this is only the beta and over here these are the tabs and and I'll make another tutorial if you want uh, showing you how to set up the Wi-Fi and how to use 
the OS and all the other features that are available. After you're done using the Google OS, all you have to do is press the power button, unplug the USB, and then press the power button again to resume to your original settings of the Windows. Uh, if you had any problems with this tutorial and if you need help, all you have to do is comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Uh, thanks for watching.